guys, it's Gaddy, and I finally have a background. Yeah! Now for today's video, I'm going to show you this really quick um, makeup look for a mom on the go in quarantine. If you guys don't know, I am a mom of two, soon to be three, more like four with the husband, and it's very exhausting looking after all of them, especially being pregnant. But there are days where I want to look like a decent human mom. And this is my go-to look for that decent human mom look. It usually takes me about 15 to 30 minutes to do this look. Now today it did take me a little bit longer because I explained every step that I was taking. Even though this video is not going to be 30 minutes long. But it took me a little bit longer to do this. But if I were to do this just like boom, 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 it would take me a... 15 to 30 minutes depending on uh, how exhausted I am that day. I'm gonna stop talking now and do my makeup on camera. Now I'm gonna prime my face with the Too Faced Hangover RX. I'm using this primer because it is currently the only one I have. It's not my favorite, but it's the only one I have. So if you guys wanna recommend a good primer, that would be awesome. I do love the e.l.f. putty one, but I do think it's a little drying. I'm losing my breath. One, it's hot. Two, I'm four weeks from giving birth. But even thinking of talking is exhausting. I'm gonna go in with my Set and Refresh Mist Morphe Times Jeffree Star Setting Spray. Mm. Now it might be a little unorthodox. I do my brows before I do my face. It's just something I do. I use my mini breaker palette and I use the color Hot Fudge. I start with the bottom first. To me, shadow on your brows makes it look a little bit more natural. I don't know, probably just me, probably just a myth, probably just what I tell myself. Now that I have my brows to my desired brown, I go in with concealer, not to clean them up, Whenever I'm doing this quick makeup look, I don't clean up my eyebrows. I don't know. I wake up an hour before I go to work. So I have an hour to like brush my teeth, wash my face, do my hair, do my makeup. So when that happens, I don't clean my eyebrows. But if I have the time, like if I'm getting ready and I have to go to like a party or I have three, four hours to get ready, then I will. But for the sake of this video, I won't clean up my eyebrows. And I just take a little bit of the Born This Way concealer in the shade Light Beige. Now I'm gonna take my Born This Way foundation in the shade Light Beige. And I make sure to apply the product all over my face. And of course, if I need more product, I will put more. I used that whole pump on one cheek. I have a Fat face, dude. Alright, now that I have applied the foundation to my face, I take a light, a light hand of powder to my eyes. And I use the Cody Airspun Loose Powder. I love, 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 love this powder. Alright, now I'm gonna contour my nose. I I absolutely have to contour my nose, okay? If I do my makeup, even if it's natural, even if it's just concealer and brows, I have to contour my nose because I hate my nose. Like, I feel like it's way too big. I'm going to take my Hula Benefit in the light shade. I love this shade to contour my nose. The tip of my nose. And because I'm not going to use eyeshadow because this is like a quick, quick, quick look I use the same bronzer and I put it on the crease of my eye and connect it to my nose contour I feel like it gives my face a little bit more definition a little bit more depth a little bit more interesting to look at you know all right after we've contoured our nose I go in with blush like I said I'm a little unorthodox I'm gonna use my Milani trio palette this one is in the shade 2 Floral Fantasy. And I start up here and then work my way down. Now, I know a lot of people don't like blush, but a lot of people love blush. But I'm one of those people that doesn't know if they love or if they hate blush. So, 
I don't put a lot of it on, but I don't put a little bit of it on. You know what I mean? Now I'm going to bronze my face, and I use the Too Faced Chocolate Soleil. Now I don't really contour again unless I'm like going out. Then I take my time and contour. This, I just use it as bronzer just to add a little bit more color to my face. Now for highlight, I'm taking my ColourPop Pressed Face Powder, and this is in the color it's like s'il vous play but it's silver play i just put some on the tip of my nose on the tip of my like nose and unibrow then when it comes to my cheeks i focus it right here like on the apples i mean it's not the most blinding highlight but it's like the most natural highlight you know and we are going for a mom on the go in a quarantine type of makeup look, you know? Basically my every workday look. Now I finish off the look with either lashes or mascara. It depends if I have time. Like if I have 10 minutes to put on lashes, then I'll finish off with lashes. But if I don't, then I'll just apply mascara and then call it good. Whew! I need a nap. I haven't applied lashes in forever, and that was the most exhausting thing I have had to do in months. I'm just gonna add a little bit of mascara to the bottom lashes. Finish off with my Starberry Setting Mist. A little bit of Carmex. Oh. What? And there you have it. This is my uh, mom on the go slash want to look mm, semi-human quarantine makeup look. All right, you guys, this is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope I entertained you because at the end of the day, that is what I am here for is for you to laugh at me like I'm your little circus clown. No, but seriously, if you did enjoy it, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't, you can give it a thumbs down. All right, if you haven't already subscribed to this channel, I mean, you're watching this video already, so might as well just subscribe. But, okay, I'm Yadi. You're awesome, and I will see you guys later. Bye.